Okay, will is used to talk about the future. First, let's look at the form. Okay, we use will plus an infinitive verb. I will understand, you will understand, he, she, and it will understand, we and they will understand. So it's very easy, it doesn't change. Now, when we are speaking, we can say will very short, okay? And we say I'll, I'll. So I'll be here, you'll be here, he'll be here, she'll be here, it'll be here, we'll be here, and they'll be here. So we can make will very short and just say all. Now the negative, I will not go, you will not go, he, she, and it will not go, and we and they will not go. Now, will not, we can also make very short and say won't, won't. So, I won't go, you won't go, sh uh, he, she, and it won't go, we and they won't go. Now, what about questions? Well, will is actually an auxiliary verb. So, remember, in questions, the auxiliary verb must go before the subject. So, will you, not you will, no question is will is first. Will you help me? Will he call you later? When, when will we arrive? And what will they do? Now, if somebody asks you a question, and your answer is yes or no, we say yes, I will, or no, I will not. And remember, will not, we can say won't. So no, I won't. Now, will has many meanings, but in 115, let's study mm, one or two main meanings of will. Now, will is used to talk about a decision. You decide, you choose to do something. But when did you decide this? You decided this now. So you decided something now about the future. And when you're speaking, you say will. Okay? So, if the phone is ringing, ding, 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 right? And it keeps ringing, ding, ding, ding. I decide now, and I say, I'll get it. I'll get the phone, right? So I decide now about the future. I'll get it. Okay. Another example: somebody is knocking on the door, right? Somebody is knocking on the door. And if, 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 if it continues knocking, 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 well, I can say, I'll answer the door. I'll answer the door. Okay? Now, when you are speaking and you decide something about the future, Sometimes this is an offer, an offer. An offer means I say I can do something for you, okay? So let's look at an example. You're hungry? You're hungry? Oh, so I decide now. I will make some dinner for you. I will make. I decided now and I say it. I will make, okay? Or maybe somebody needs help, and, and I say, oh, I'll give you a hand. Now, give you a hand means help you, okay? So we use, in, uh, excuse me, we use will in English when we decide something now about the future. 
If you'd like to practice this grammar, please click on the link in the video.